In today's video, we witness the return of the Lars. What's up guys, we're back with another insane mystery box opening sent to me by the legend Lars. So Lars sent me this box, as you can see, it's kind of, it's not huge, but it's also too big for the camera, a little bit too tall. Lars has sent us many mystery boxes in the past. If you guys have not seen these, we're gonna post some of them on the screen, but we have pulled some of the best cards like in the channel's history for Lars. And not only that, he almost sent us a first edition Ghost Rare Stardust Dragon Pack that he opened himself instead. So this guy has the magic touch, whether it's me opening for him or himself opening for him, he knows how to pick the packs before we hop into the mystery box we have a giveaway i'll be giving away these two well actually lars is giving these away me and lars i'll send them he's he's giving them uh we have two collector rares so uh you can win the shinanome and the mamamanka ma Mamanaka. Yeah, whatever. I said that wrong. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below. What do you think about Lars's new mystery box? And uh, what do you think we're going to pull? So let's just get this thing open. I have no idea what to expect. All he did was say, headed your way with a picture of the box. That was it. So I have no idea what's in here. Literally no idea. Like I, I do unknown stuff where like I'd seen it and forgotten, you know, a lot of the time. This time I literally have no idea. Like he didn't give me a hint or anything. Oh my gosh. What is this? I've never seen this thing before. Okay, I have never seen this. Okay, so we got like, like, uh, what, what, what is, is this like the movie or something? Why does he look like this? I can't remember when he looks like this. 19 plus value for only $9.99. I'm guessing that uh, based on that pack on, on the front right there, that this is worth a lot more than $9.99. But five factory sealed packs, a third party product I've never seen before, which there always seems to be more. And I'm so happy that there is. It's so exciting. Factory sealed packs. Very cool. Not, okay, Strike and Neos, Cyberdark Impact. Not as exciting as Strike and Neos, but still pretty cool. Uh, it doesn't really give you a hint as to what's inside besides those two. So three packs that we have no idea about. We got Slifer and Yugi. We've got Yugi, Wing Dragon, Ara, Obelisk. I mean, there's, oh my goodness, this is gonna be insane. This is only the first item, oh my gosh. Let's do it, let's open this thing up. All right, first item. We have had good luck with Strike and Neos recently. You guys may have seen that. If you haven't, go check out some recent videos. You might have seen some, you might see something pretty amazing. Here we go. Let's get this thing open. I don't really want to necessarily reveal the five packs if I can avoid it. Maybe I can go one at a time. Let's try to, okay, I don't know. I don't know if we can. I think we just got to go like this and get this. How do you even get these? I don't know. We're just going to have to reveal them. Okay. So first edition tactical evolution unlimited oh, i wish that was first dead first dead tactical evolution isn't bad uh there's three more in this little thing let's see if we can get them out little book here oh that looks like force of the breaker power of the duelist if i had to guess and are they first ed unlimited 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 so we got one first ed pack but okay so we're gonna do this order first ed will go last because it's first ed then strike a neos then we don't have a lot of force of the breaker so we'll do this order because we've opened a lot of cyber dark impact power of the duelist but still really good packs inside, potentially. So let's see what we can get. Or not packs, cards inside the packs. One, two, three, four. We have a Baki. We're over an old school. Let's see what we can get for the legend Lars. Jane Dennett. I'm expecting a lot because it's Lars. Dark Lucius level four. We have a Chain Strike. Barrier Statue of the Abyss. We got Justy Break. And we have... Barrier Statue of the Drought. Okay, there's another one. And a oh, Vanity's Fiend. That would be a good ultimate rare, actually. All right, next pack, Power of the Duelist. Let's see what we can do. Okay, phone's being weird. There, oh yeah, that looks crispy. All right, Power of the Duelist Unlimited. I don't know if this is a hobby pack or what. I don't even, uh, Unlimited, I'm always confused if there even is hobby. I think it depends on if it's Euro, but Euro might not even have Unlimited. So I don't even know. Mausoleum of the Emperor. We have Miracle Jurassic, or maybe only some are only euro if they're unlimited i don't know alien skull you gotta ask more of the gx people royal rate of taxation we have d spirit crystals dolphin black terra flying saucer muscle and uh, supercharge all right supercharge is the one you never want to see as an ultimate rare so good thing it wasn't an ulti that would have been uh well i mean it'd still be one pack ulti but it'd be like ah oh, this one give us that eradicator epidemic virus please never pulled that before one two three four we have dweller in the depths overworld otherworld the a zone sorry we have volcanic recharge crystal beats ruby garbuncle the original print magna slash dragon blaze accelerator crystal blessing Hard selling zombie, not the goblin, and oh, a soul of fire. I think I pulled two of these when we opened the blister box, which I should not have opened that. 
<laughs> Should not have opened that at all. We did get a couple of PSA 10 Doomfires though, which was, so we got something out of it, but not insane. But okay, that's a pretty cool card. Strike and Eos, they're a little bent up from being in the third party package. That's okay. We need the Forbidden Yu-Gi-Oh card. There's also DD Crow Ultimate Rare. There's also Grandma Ultimate Rare. There's also some secrets that I can't remember, but there's some good ones in here. We have Emblem of the Awakening. Six Samurai, come on, because I never pull secrets out of here. Like ever, Grin Tactician of Dark World. Destruction Cyclone, Flashbang, Lycanthrope, the normal ritual card, Electric Virus, and we have Frostosaurus, another pretty cool looking ulti if you can actually pull it. Pretty cool, but not what we're looking for. Final pack magic here before we move on to the rest of the mystery box, there's still a lot left. First edition tactical evolution. Look, I've already pulled him an unlimited rainbow dragon before. Before he's pulled the first dead Stardust Dragon, it's time to pull. Time to pull the first dead Ghost Rare right here. We have Cocoon Veil. Let's just do it. Crystal's Pantail, Venom Shot, King Pyron, Venom Cobra, Flint Missile, Flint Lock. Chrysalis Larva, and we have a Blazewing Butterfly. So hey, look, there was a super in the first edition pack. We cannot complain about that. Though I will say we did somehow pull less than $9.99. Actually, this did get this did get really expensive in ulti, so I don't know about the super, but I think we got under the $9.99, unfortunately. All right, next item, I don't even know what it is. I'm just gonna put my hand in there without looking. Uh, I'm gonna try to, let's do this. Try to go over to that side. Okay, this feels extra large. What is this? Oh, gold series hot in mind. One of my favorites. This is a guaranteed gold ghost rare hybrid card available for the first time ever and the last time since is what I should say. Okay, we really want the blue eyes. Solemn Judgment's good. Mystical Space Typhoon's good. Gores, we've gotten a lot of those before. <laughs> okay, gold series haunted mine. Let's go one pack. That's it. One singular pack. Let's see what we can get from this sucker. I think it's sort of in the middle somewhere. Yeah, I think it's in the middle around that spot. So I'm going to just skip three like that. Do that. Okay, we didn't ruin it. Patrician of Darkness. Dark Scorpion Manet the Thorns. Zoma. Double Costin. Dark Mimic level three. Hell Palmer. Book of Life. This this probably has like more value than that whole other other thing. Just this one pack. Gurnia, though this is worth like a lot. <laughs> it's like 75 bucks a pack. Dark Mimic. We have Physical Double. Ryu Koki. Little Lady in White. The Dawn of the Herald. Dark Scorpion, Gork, the Strong. Zombie Master. Not a lot of cards in here, but there's a lot of decent, like, commons inside. Tiki Curse, Fear from the Dark. I think the first foil is the ghost, though. Pyramid Turtle, if I'm correct. Hidden Spellbook. I think that's a big one, actually. Call the Mummy. We've got Red Ogre. Vampire Lady. Okay, there it is. I think that's it. So I think we got to go to the last card. Yeah, Kara Curry Steel Shogun. That's a, go a gold rare, not a ghost rare. Maturia Beast. That's a pretty good one. And our last card right here is the gold ghost rare, which we really want to be a blue eyes white dragon. They have a lot of print lines normally, so they're hard to grade. So we want no print line blue eyes right here. Okay, Solemn Judgment. That's pretty good. And how does it look? Maybe a little ding on the foil on the right there. I'm not seeing the print lines. They can be hard to see, though. But honestly, it looks pretty clean besides that one little ding. Pretty nice looking card. I mean, I mean, beautiful. I love the gold ghosts. I just think the foil on them is really good. I don't know if the gold is actually factoring in at all. I think it's just the foiling that they did on these look really nice. Okay, next item we have. What in the world is this? Phantom Darkness? Oh... Vintage sports cards blister pack. So we know about them, vintage sports cards. Okay, this is this is super cool. It's unlimited, but okay, that this is gonna hurt to open. Even though it's not an original, it is repackaged, but they did get some really cool looking stuff. So here we go, vintage sports cards. Prints on these are pretty nice. Uh, I'm destroying this pack slowly. Can we get a dark arm dragon today? That would be one I have never pulled in secret. I pulled it in uh ulti though, so that's pretty cool. But that took a hundred packs or whatever, so it wasn't easy. All right, that was not easy thanks to the glue on the back, but I did finally get it off. Okay, here we go. 2008 set. Can we get a secret rare dark arm dragon? Let's do this. Let's go. One, two, th I'm going to do three because I don't know if it's four or not on this one. We have Cyber Ouroboros set. I don't get to open very often. We have pulled an error pack out of one of these before. The Calculator, Obsidian Dragon, Proxen Special, Gemini Lancer. These are kind of slick. Gladiator's Proving Ground, Cybernetic Hidden Technology, Disney Departed, Six Samurai United, 
and a Mirage tube. It's like YouTube, but with a Mirage. Okay, next item, unfortunately, nothing out of... That would have been pretty cool to get a Dark Arm Dragon or a secret or something. But don't worry, we got plenty of other good secrets to choose from. Gladiator's Assault. Special... This is... This is an opening today. Let's just destroy this thing real quick. So we can pull the magic formula. Let's just do it. Magic formula. We get our promo card, the legendary Vortex Trooper. Okay, we get two Gladiator's Assault, one Dark Crisis. Unfortunately, you only get two Gladiator's Assault. Dark Crisis, sure. I mean, I think some of the, sometimes these are EN packs, which means they have the, you know, the EN at the end or on the uh, set code. Okay, come on, get out of here. Do these, these do not. So I think it has to be European. One, two, three from the back, I guess is what we're gonna do. Battle Footballer, not that season. Precious Cards from Beyond, Goblins Agreed, Ruxin and Special, and then 10 Dogs. Contract with Exodia, Dark Scorpion, Mane the Thorn, Arsenal Robber, Sukiyomi, is there a foil? Oh, nothing, okay, Sukiyomi. Great rare. Well, it's like four to seven bucks, so I don't know what it is now, but pretty nice. I and mean, DCR reprint probably hurt a little bit, but there's no booster boxes, so it probably didn't hurt that bad. Glass, 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 glass. What can you pull? Can we get, okay, if we can get a formula, we've already been fired this, this month. We pulled, well, I guess that was technically last month. So in the last like month of time, we've been on fire. We pulled Blue Eyes First Edition. We pulled uh, Air Neos Ultimate Rare. It's time to pull Magic Formula, right? We have Fog Control, let's do it. Gambler of Legend. Light Imprisoning Mirror, Gladiator Beast Hoplimus, Cloudy and Squall, Natural Disaster, Super Alloy Beast Raptinus, Updraft, no, Updraft, why do you always appear? So it was four from the back, interesting. Updraft is always in a Gladiator's Assault opening. No matter how many packs you open, you will pull one. Two packs, we already got one. Updraft Super, at least it's not an ulti, I guess. Which is super weird to say, because I guess we'd want it to be an ulti, but in like a box, you don't want it to be an ulti. Okay, next glass pack, come on. Glass, 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 let's do it. One, two, I'm gonna do three again, just to be safe. I'm scared of it moving. We have Alien Hypno, don't want to ruin it. No entry after that, Air Neos incident. Uh, contract out. We have Natural Disaster, Super Alloy Beast wrapped in its Lucky Cloud, Interdimensional Warp, Alien Telepath, and Magical Reflect Slime. Okay, we got a foil, I guess. Okay, ooh, we got another one. Phantom Darkness, another booster pack. Let's go, that is amazing. All right, got it out, Phantom Darkness. Here we go. Dark Arm Dragon, are you awaiting us inside this pack? Instant Neo Space. Let's go. We have Sea Koala, Regenerating Rose, Disney Hero Departed, Double Tag Team, Dark Crusader, Sinister Seeds, Metabo Globster. Oh no! It looks like some Star Wars creature. And Imprison Queen Archfiend Metago Bo Globster. Oh, Metago. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying there. Okay, we'll try the next thing. All right, here are a bunch of Dark Crisis. Looks like six of. I'm not Dark Crisis. Le Legacy of Darkness, I should say. Unlimbs. Let's see if we can get Yada or Injection Fairy Lily. Then we have one more pretty awesome item in the mystery box. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it so far. It's been super fun. Shout out to Lars for the awesome opening. Let's see if we can actually get him something good because so far we've actually not pulled anything that crazy, which normally we do. We have Skull Knight number two, Dragon's Rage, Ryu Kishin Clown, Heart of Clear Water, and After Genocide, After the Struggle, whatever you want to call it these days. Here we go. Next pack magic legacy of darkness warrior die greffer dragon dwelling in the cave we have spirits invitation twin headed wolf cave dragon skull nine number two dragon's rage re kitchen clown oh and an ultra rare fiber jar let's go all right there we go that's our biggest pull so far i think ultra rare fiber jar any stars on the back no looks like maybe that didn't come from the tcg player order all right that's pretty amazing fiber jar ultra rare so that's our best pull yet let's go all right lod i got high expectations i think you can pull something else wait did i do four i don't know what i just did nutrient z i think i did okay where did i grab for dragon dwelling in the cave rux and special spirit imitation fang Xing mirror patrician of darkness a faint plan cave dragon and the a forces okay the a forces three down three to go and then we got a final box to open one two three four we have the Puppet Magic Dark Ruler, Grey Wing, uh, Ready for Intercepting, Nutrient Z, Troop Dragon, Fang Xing Mirror, Patrician of Darkness, A Faint Plan, and an Air Knight! 
Hide bar chat. LOD are showing up for us. Two ultras in four packs. These are one in 12, by the way, to get an ultra. One in 12 packs. So we had half the packs to get one, and we got ended up with two in four packs. So that's pretty ridiculous. And two good ones, too. Aeronite Fiber Jar, probably two of the biggest of uh, from Legacy Darkness in terms of ultras. Let's see if we can get a secret now. If we get a secret, these are the best packs ever. Twin Headed Wolf, we got Bubble Crash, Robotic Knight, Double Snare, Dragon's Rage, Rekishing Clown, Heart of Clear Water, Ominous Fortune Telling. Oh, and a ray of revealing light. We're digressors on every single artwork. Last pack, Legacy of Darkness. Will you pull us something amazing? One, two, three, four. Double Snail, Devil Snare, Soul Demolition, Convulsion of Nature, Woodland Sprite, Ominous Fortune Telling, Mysterious Guard, Stamping Destruction, Spring of Rebirth, and the Fatal Abacus. Okay, we can't complain. Two for six, two ultras out of six packs. That's insane. Okay, I said there was one more thing. There's actually um, there's actually two more things. So uh, we got this first, which we have seen these from him before. These are a Yu-Gi-Oh! GX third-party blisters. Two packs inside, which we can see are Lost Millennium Ancient Sanctuary. Very cool, and they used to be $4.99. Not anymore. All right, we got the packs out. Uh, as you can see, we got a little, little tail going on there. Ancient Sanctuary. Wait, this isn't first. Oh, it is first, Ed. Whoa, okay, we'll save that one then. Let's do uh, Lost Millennium first, unlimited. So this one's unlimited, nothing on the top, so I can open it normally. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Let's pull something crazy. Let's get focused in. We have Kamenate Blow, also the Earth Charmer. Shifting Shadows, Lost Guardian, Elements Your Hero Clayman, Level Conversion Lab, Elements Your Hero Sparkman, Pikachu Second Sight, and Nitro Unit. Nothing in there, but we do have a First Ed Ancient Sanctuary pack to make up for it. Let's see what we can do. One, two, three, four. First edition, can we get the enemy controller? Weapon change. We got Protector, Mermaid, Jiu Jitsu Art of Transformation, Emissary of the Oasis, Micro Ray, Disc Fighter, Soul Reversal, and we have Avatar of the Bot. First edition. Hey, not bot agreed first, Dad, but hey, we'll take it. And the final item is another one of these awesome ones from the beginning. Check that out. Gladiator's Assault, Five Factor Sealed Packs. We got Force of the Breaker as well. Let's get these out. We have Gladiator's Assault, which is pretty exciting. Is it first set? Hopefully. Let's see, we have, okay. We Oh, no, is that a Duelist Pack? Oh, Duelist Pack, Chaz. Okay, we got Cyber Dark Impact. Uh, this is not one to focus. First set on the Force of the Breaker. Oh, wait, we got six on this one. Wait, time out. They gave us a bonus pack. I don't think they were supposed to give us two Cyber Dark Impact. We got an error pack. We had glass. We got uh, two force of the breakers so wait maybe maybe you were and maybe not the chats i don't know that's pretty strange so bonus packs we'll take it chats brinston this is a bonus pack we can handle it let's see what chad the chats can do for us all right chaz we got z metal x head level modulation v tiger an arm dragon level five nothing too crazy there okay first ed cyber dark impact be come on be hobby that'd be pretty cool send laura some luck in the comments guys and thank him once again for this awesome video and uh we haven't had as good of pulls for him as normally because normally he just pulls ridiculous but we have had some pretty good ones thanks to the legacy of darkness by road we have barrier statue come on focus up we have a uh, ruxin special accumulated fortune barrier statue of the inferno chain strike barrier statue of the abyss and combo Masters. Okay, sounds good. Sure. Let's try Force of the Breaker. Also first ed. So this one has a lot more first ed packs, which is pretty nice. Doesn't have strike and EOS, but it does have first edition packs, which is pretty big. Can we get the big boy? The Eradicator Epidemic Virus Secret Rare. Can we get Ryza Ultimate Rare? Look cut my life into pieces. Alright, we have Amber Mammoth. We have Abundance and Firewall. The Firewall Dragon before it's time. Not quite. Okay, Cyber Dark Impact. Also first ed. What can you give us, Cyber Dark Impact? One, two, three, four. Cyber Dark Dragon Ulti. We have Barrier Statue, By Road Sacrifice, Barrier Statue of the Torrent, Linear Accelerator, Ritual Foregone, Combo Fighter, Flame Ogre, Venity's Call, and a Flash of the Forbidden Spell. Two packs left. If you guys have enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. We will be opening vintage packs, new packs, doing other stuff that's not opening packs occasionally. Make sure you subscribe for the content. Here we go. Seismic Crasher, Fieldberry. And by the way, if you like opening packs, I have over 1,500 videos doing that. So go check it out. Heart Cell and Zombie. We have Gravity Crush Dragon, Wildfire, and uh, Triggered Summon. Yeah, 1,500 videos. You probably think you've seen them all, some of you guys. There's probably one you've missed. Go see if you can find it. Go see if you can find it. 
Gladiator's Assault, first edition, last pack magic. Can we get that Ghost Rare casting? Yes. Can we get the Error Card, Rainbow Dragon? Can we get the uh, Secret Rares? I mean, uh, Glass has some amazing ones like Magic Formula, Necro Face, all that stuff. Let's do three. Okay, Over Limit, last pack magic, Secutor, Battle Halberd, Gambler of Legend, Light Imprisoning Mirror, Truckroid, Summon Cloud, Express Roid, and we have Cloudian Smoke Ball. Okay, so Lars, not quite the usual Lars magic, but he still did have some nice pulls. Shout out to Lars in the comments. Shout out to Tom Fo Show, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutster, Another Toy Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F., Thomas McLean, Changalang, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.